Hello, my name is Steve Bowler, and in this video, I'm going to be configuring MPLS VPNs. In particular, within MPLS VPNs, we're going to be taking a look at running Enhanced Interior Gateway Routing Protocol, EIGRP, from Customer Edge to Premise Edge. We're going to be taking a look at how to set this up. We're going to be taking a look at mutual redistribution between multi-protocol BGP and EIGRP done on the premise edge routers. We're going to be running OSPF as the IGP for the ISP network. And what we can see from this diagram is that we have five routers, router one, two, three, four, and five. Router one and router five are going to be simulating our premise, I'm sorry, our customer edge routers, our CE routers and router 2 and router 4 are going to be simulating our premise edge routers while router 3 is going to be simulating a P router and it's strictly going to be doing MPLS and running only the IGP within the ISP network. So we're going to be running multi-protocol BGP from router 2 to router 4 and we're going to be performing mutual redistribution between BGP and in this case within our MPLS VPN Lab 3 we're going to be taking a look at the specific case of running EIGRP from customer edge to premise edge and some of the characteristics involved in doing so. And then we're going to finish up this lab taking a look at uh, simulating a backdoor link between router 1 and router 5 and we're going to be taking a look at how we can manipulate route propagation by s looking at this backdoor link and manipulating the manipulating the metric or cost that we give this link so let's go ahead and get into our routers here. We're going to be getting into router 1 first. And what we're going to do is we're just going to, first off, we're going to be configuring EIGRP from customer edge to premise edge. So the first thing we're going to do is on the customer edge is where the simplest of the configuration is done. So in this case what we can see from our diagram we're going to be running EIGRP and AS1 on R1 and R2, R4 and R5. So we'll start here on R1 